electric car. It's been very popular. That's great. Since electric vehicles have zero emission, they can improve street level air quality, reduce greenhouse gases emission, and tackle climate change. It should be encouraged. The government has been actively promoting the wider use of electric vehicles. Let's listen to the expert. The government has introduced various measures, such as taking the lead in using electric vehicles, working with the private sector to expand the charging network, and encouraging suppliers to introduce suitable models into Hong Kong. With the breakthroughs in electric vehicle technologies in recent years, the number of electric cars has been growing and they are more commonly seen now. You can apply for the government's Pioneer Green Transport Fund and buy an electric car. The fund aims to subsidize the adoption of green and innovative technologies by the public transport sectors, truck owners, and charitable and non-profit making organizations. It is not intended for general public. Actually, we should choose public transportation, drive less and walk more. If we really need a car, pick an electric vehicle. The buses should go electric as well. You're right. So the government plans to gradually increase the number of zero-emission buses in Hong Kong and has allocated 180 million Hong Kong dollars to help franchise bus companies to purchase 36 single-deck electric buses and charging facilities for trial runs. If the results are satisfactory, the government will consider expanding the use of electric buses. Are there enough charging facilities for so many vehicles? Private housing estates should have their own charging spots. The government has been working with the commercial sector to expand the charging facilities in all 18 districts of Hong Kong. You can visit EPD website to find the locations of charging stations. Existing buildings may consider the intelligent load management system for their parking spaces. The system can control the power allocation of individual charger to maximize the use of energy. As for public spaces, over 1,500 charges are available in the parking spaces of shopping malls hotels and car parks throughout Hong Kong. It is easy to charge your vehicle anywhere. The government will continue to work closely with the commercial sector to expand and optimize the charging network. In addition, the EPD also has a dedicated team and a hotline to provide relevant information and technical support for residential developments, organizations and individuals interested in installing charging facilities. If you are interested, you may ask your property manager to call 3757-6222. Is it clear? Yes. Let's use public transportation, drive less and walk more.